Okay, this will be the 2020 AMC 10A problem number one. I hope you all had success on this test. Let's get to it. What value of x satisfies this equation? You're simply going to multiply by 12 immediately. 12x minus 9, um, because 12 over 4 is 3 times 3 is 9, equals 5 minus 4. That's 1. Add 9 to get 10. Divide by 12 to get 5 over 6. All right, and on to the 2020 10A problem two. The numbers 3, 5, 7, A, and B have an average of 15. What is the average of A and B? Just carry out what it says. Add this up. 10 plus 5 is 15 plus A plus B. You added five things. Divide by 5, it should equal 15. Immediately multiply to get 75. Subtract 15 to get 60. Divide by 2 to get A plus B over 2, which is the average, and is 30. And continuing on with the 2020 10A problem 3, assuming A does not equal 3, B does not equal 4, and C does not equal 5, what is the value in the simplest form of the following expression? What you want to observe is that a minus 3 and 3 minus a are identical if I pull out a negative sign. So negative times a minus 3 equals 3 minus a. And so because of that, this will cancel to make negative 1. 5 minus c and c minus 5 will cancel. b minus 4 and 4 minus b will cancel. You have three negative 1s, the product of which is negative 1. Now on the 2020 10a problem number 4, a driver travels for two hours at 60 miles per hour, during which her car gets 30 miles per gallon of gas. She is paid 50 cents per mile, and her only expense is gasoline at $2 per gallon. What is her net rate of pay in dollars per hour after this expense? So dollars per hour, we don't care she's traveling for two hours. Let's just do one hour and we'll get the correct rate because it's the same for both hours. Um, at 60 miles per hour, uh, she's going to go 60 miles and she gets paid 50 cents per mile. So half of 60 is $30. Then her only expense is gas, which costs her uh, $2 per gallon and she gets 30 miles per gallon of gas. So if she goes 60 miles, that's going to equal 2 gallons of gas. And we can simply subtract 2 times $2, which is $4, to get 26. All right, and the last problem of the set, the 2020 10A problem 5. What is the sum of all real numbers x for which the absolute value of this equals 2? Immediately pull off the absolute values and make it 12x plus 34 equals positive 2. And also negative 12x plus 34 equals negative 2. Then you're just simply going to move the 2 over. x squared minus 12x plus 32 equals 0. And x squared minus 12x plus 36 equals 0. If you try to use uh, some of the roots, you will get 12 over 1 and 12 over 1. Lucky for you, there's no 24. And the reason is this one is a perfect square trinomial, so you only get the one solution, 6. Uh, up here, you're going to have x minus 4, x minus 8 equals 0. They do sum to 12. We're okay there. 12 and 6 is 18.